Today we're going to help impress your tailgating friends with good old hot dogs. Welcome to Inside Tailgating, I'm Ryan Alessio and today our secret six pack is focused on a staple of the tailgating world, the hot dog. We're here at Susie's Dogs and Drafts, purveyors of gourmet hot dog deliciousness and they're going to show us how to take an ordinary hot dog and make it out of this world extraordinary. And welcome where all the magic happens here at Susie's Dogs and Drafts. I'm here with Chef Jen and she's going to show us six hot dogs that you can translate into your tailgate lot. Chef Jen, yes. ready to get started? I'm ready. All right, I'm let's ready. do it. What are we doing first? So our first hot dog is going to be a regular seven inch house dog and we're going to do sloppy joe and just regular onion, keeping it simple. I like it. Sloppy joe, now you could probably use that to what, replace maybe chili or something like that? I prefer it over chili, honestly. It has, has a lot more flavor, a lot more seasoning to it. I noticed before you put on the sloppy joe mix, your, the hot dog, when you brought it out of the steamer, it actually had a cut down the middle of it. Is there a reason that you do that? Uh, we cut our hot dogs down the center. I mean, it cooks them faster in the steamer for us, but then it also holds the toppings that we put on better. That's a good tip if you're tailgating. <laughs> cut down the middle, load it up. Our next hot dog that we're gonna do is gonna be another just regular hot dog with Velveeta and then SpaghettiOs. So here we go. We got some, Vel is that Velveeta cheese sauce? Yep. Look at that. You can get that any store, easy ingredient, slit down the middle again. And then you got your SpaghettiOs. Look at that. And that's just regular old, oh wait, check this out. In case you have any doubts, Campbell's SpaghettiOs. What's number three on the list, Chef Jen? All right, our next one, we're gonna do the Chicago dog. Most people know what a Chicago dog is. So our first thing that we're gonna do is we have a little bit of bacon slaw. Uh, we do a little bit of Roma tomatoes. We kind of just squeeze them down the side. Our next thing are some little sport peppers to kind of give it a little kick with it. This is great because this isn't some fancy stuff you had flown in from some exotic location. Nope, I can go to I any mean, store, supermarket and get every ingredient for this hot dog. Pretty much. And then you just want to top it off with your bacon. That's money. So for the next hot dog, we're gonna drop an egg. It's gonna go right on top when it's done cooking. I noticed you got a different bun here. I do. This bun is a New England bun. You can buy it at any grocery store, basically. They sell them. Ours are toasted. Coat it in some butter, put it on the grill. We're gonna do um, a little bit of barbecue sauce. Uh, it's a Blackson barbecue, which is made from molasses. We're gonna put a little bit of pickled red bell peppers on it, a little bit of onions and then we're gonna top it off with the barbecue sauce. All right, and then to finish this one, just sprinkle a little salt and pepper on the egg, and then it's finished. Throw oh, it right on top. Good. Marry me. All right, moving along to our next hot dog. What do we got? It's gonna be sriracha cream cheese, jalapenos, and then some more bacon. Uh, how did you, how do you make this? Is it really as simple as it sounds? Blend it in, you add a bit, little bit of heavy cream to thin it out some. I mean, it's amazing. See, these are all great things you can do to make yourself look like a hot dog pro, and they're not really that difficult to do, even though the names might sound a little difficult. All right, we already got our five gourmet hot dogs that Chef Jen made for us, so that, that, those look fantastic, and I'm dying to eat one. Although we have a little surprise. You probably wouldn't think dessert and hot dog in the same sentence, but. I mean, if there's a will, there's a way. You can do anything. So we're I'm gonna ready. put some marshmallow. Just a little bit of... No, you're not. We're gonna put marshmallow. Just some whipped marshmallow. All right, a little bit of ground up chocolate on there. And you could do graham cracker, you could do pretzel. You could put whatever you want on it. You know what, everybody does graham crackers. Why don't we try the pretzel round? Pretzels? I, I've yet to see this, so. All right. Wow, look at that. Dessert hot dog, unheard of. Chef Jen showed us how to make these six gourmet hot dogs that you can translate to your tailgating party. And for six gourmet hot dogs, I had to bring in the big guns. My buddy Chez is gonna help me sample these delicious dogs. You ready? I'm eating this one. Dig in. I think myself, I'm gonna try this. I, I gotta try this one with the egg. I'm a fan of the egg. Hey, cheers. Cheers. That's all for this episode of Inside Tailgating. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter at Tailgate With Us. You can follow me on Twitter at Ryan Alessio. And for all the latest articles and news on the tailgating world, check out our website, insidetailgating.com. 
You want to try that one? Yeah, I'm going to try, try this. this one. All right. This hot one here. This is the jalapeno one. You're going to have to take me to the hospital. I didn't oh, drive. Oh, it's so hot. Oh, it's so hot. <laughs> you should walk it down with that milkshake. <laughs> <laughs>